Be who you are. Ask for the likes, ask for the subscribers while you, and be bold about it. There are people that want to subscribe to your channel. People need the connection. People need connection. We cannot do this alone. Because at the end of the day, man, listen. How about Shondo? Hey y'all. <laughs> Good morning. All of those who are morning birds and a good good morning to those who struggle with it listen i'm your girl nelly d and welcome to the nelly drayton show where creatives gather and try to go beyond i got some stuff i want to say let's get into it oh really quick um i want to point something out about myself um nelly janelle almost at my middle name because i'm very disappointed um, why when you record, you don't look into the camera, you look at the screen instead of looking into the camera, how are you going to develop a relationship with the people that you are wanting to pour into if you can't even look them in the, anyways, I'm going to fix that right on up. I was watching some of my videos, just editing and, and trying to get through a lot of, uh, traumatic things that continue to take place currently. Um, I realized I kind of struggle with looking into the camera. I'm like, is that a thing? Is that, is that a thing that we're gonna have to talk about with, with the therapist? Danielle, Danielle, I have a problem. Houston, we have a problem. But regardless of that, I'm gonna definitely work on that. The other thing that I've noticed, like I've watched some of my favorite YouTubers, um, some that I've recently just got into, like I just recently started getting into poise. I love gamers. I love gamers. Just, just a little tad bit of information. My daughter started, um, forcing me to watch Rico the Giant. And I like Rico. There was a video of him playing uh, Kanito Pet. Poor Rico, Rico was going through it. As a person that has like multiple devices, I'm afraid of like seeing my mouse move. I, I don't know why. And it's a it's a horror film um, excitement thing as well, right? Cause I like horror film. I like scary stuff. Don't ask me why I just do. But I be thinking like one day my mouse is gonna move. You know, I'm gonna see it jumping on the screen because someone didn't hack the system. They didn't hack the LED software. They didn't hack the LED firmware. Shout out to Rico the Giant for getting through Kanito Pet because that game looks scary. And of course, you all know that I love Corey X Kenshin. Don't come for me in my face or my broken nail. I just woke up and this is how I look fresh out the bed. Um, all I did was brush my teeth, got me my little face clints and all that good stuff but anyways the real topic of discussion here is the title we're gonna stick to the title i know i went off a little bit but we're gonna bring it back run that back one more time i want a thousand subscribers on youtube it's just really plain and simple but you know what i've noticed i've noticed that when you're not authentically asking for it you're not going to get it how do you get a thousand subscribers on youtube you be consistent number one provide content that's relatable provide content that is your content. Can't nobody else steal it. Can't nobody else trademark it. Corey X Kenshin is like one of the goaded YouTubers that I personally, because no one can do what Corey does. No matter what you do, it don't matter how you're feeling, it don't matter. You're never, there's never going to be another Corey X Kenshin. He literally says it all the time. He's like, I am the Shogun. And it's like, it's crazy because you are like you. <laughs> went back in time to watch some of his old videos and I was like, oh my God, this confidence came from a long, it came from a, a far, a, a long line of growth. And I feel like that's the way to get your subscribers up. Let the people see your journey. At some point, you're going to change in life. When you're creating, you're evolving. You're doing something that you've never done before. You're stepping into a realm that's very unknown, but there's literally probably a million other people who would love to watch you go through that so that they're motivated to do it just like you. I'm literally recording this on the DG Pocket 2, the creator combo. Hello, I made a video about it. Don't mind the mic because I'm about to do a podcast with Drew. I want a thousand subscribers. I need to be more intentional about being like, hey guys, Listen, go ahead and that like, that subscribe. And if you haven't subscribed, make sure you like. And if you liked it, then go ahead and subscribe. I need to be more intentional about it. Like this video. If you like this video, like this video. Give a girl a like. It ain't nothing but two seconds to put that thick thumb. 
pause. My nail's broken. I said that like my nail wasn't broken. That's so ghetto. Listen, it ain't nothing to give a like. Give a like to the video. Hit subscribe. Check out the other videos on my content. I am a podcaster. I am an up and coming filmmaker. I am slowly tapping into the, I'm not even going to say slowly because that's minimizing what I'm already doing. My professor would be very disappointed if she heard me say that about myself. I'm writing. And the way I'm writing, baby, all I'm going to say is if you see me on Netflix, don't get mad if I act brand new because rightfully so, that's what I'm going to do. Bars. Oh, my God. I am not new to this. I am true to this. I don't wake up on 10 all the time. I'm just excited. I'm excited because a lot of things are changing in a good way and in a bad way, right? The good and the bad, you definitely gotta mix that sucker up and make it into something that's gonna work for you. And I'm just happy, I'm grateful because I didn't think that I would make it this far. I didn't think that I would make it. I'm, I, that's all I'm gonna say. We Listen, give me to a thousand subscribers and I'm gonna tell y'all the gut-wrenching story of my life. I'm telling you, if I can get through it, if anything, just know if somebody picks up the script that I'm about to submit, I'm telling you, you're gonna see my story and a lot of women, a lot of daughters, a lot of, of mothers can relate to my story. My professor, she, you know, she cheered me on about my script. She revised it and she sent it back and she's like, this is so relatable. Like you need to, Janelle, work on this and finish this. And I was like, bro, don't get me. I didn't say bro to her, but in my head, I'm like, professor, like, I don't, I done glitched into the matrix. <laughs> Trying to collect my thoughts because I'm supposed to be getting ready to do this podcast with Drew and I don't even know what we're supposed to talk about. Did he text my phone? He did. <clears throat> so what was I talking about? Um, 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 oh yeah, so I'm in school. Again, college isn't for everybody. I am a witness to that. And it's not because I don't want to learn because my professors are baths of knowledge. I'm just a sponge at heart. I'm always going to be a sponge. I'm going to be 50 and be a sponge. I'm going to be 95 and be a sponge. You understand the words that's coming out of my mouth? Learn from everything and everybody. I will never be the smartest person in the room. If I am, I'm walking out. And that's something, if anything, you all could take with you. If you are a small YouTuber, share with your people. Because I'm sitting here talking about my school stuff. Don't nobody, none of the people that subscribe to me know that I'm in college. Share with the people what you got going on. I'm in transition. I'm about to move to a different state. I am at a place in my life where I really am grateful that I went through some terrible things as a kid growing up, still dealing with terrible things and being able to have like-minded individuals who support me who actually go out of their way to be there for me and to show up I, I honestly i'm grateful for my friends they are my family like they know that i would literally do anything for them I try my best to be that light i try my best to be that motivation and even one of my best friends last night man i wanted to get teary-eyed but i was a little too <clears throat> i was heavily influenced under recreational behaviors that involve being in a state of enjoyment that makes it sound so much worse i was having adult beverages you know mimosas and things like that talking with my friend and she's on to something and i'm like this is crazy because never would i have ever guessed i really helped you get somewhere where you want to be or question things I didn't know that. I honestly don't even know the type of influence I have on people. I don't know that, but people have to come back and tell me like, you know, I really thought about a lot of stuff that you said, or, you know, being around you is like a breath of fresh air. Being like, when people come back and tell me these things, like even my professor sent me this email saying like, you are a giant light to the world and you have so much and da 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 da. And I'm like, okay, that's great, but what? I'm glad for the, you know what I'm saying? It got hot in here real fast because I feel like I'm about to freak. <laughs> But I'm in school. I'm a filmmaker. I have a podcast. Do you all know that I have a podcast? Did you stumble on my channel and see that I have a podcast? Or did you see me react until one of my <laughs> one of my colleagues or a short film don't sleep? That's like, I'm telling you, I feel so bad for my daughter because she was sitting right next to me and enduring the pain that is reacting to a horror short film. I love them. I love them. If anything, I be wanting people to send me their horror short films if they have one or if they tap into that genre and they want me to react to it listen i ain't I, i'm trying i'm I, because i love horror and i'm a filmmaker so i have like two short visuals that's on my channel one of them's like the otr series i was trying to create a series and then 
some stuff took place, some stuff happened, boom, one of the actors, he ain't even here in, in the state no more. And that's a whole nother conversation for another day. But that, you know, I, I hate having to rewrite something without the original characters. It, it, you know, in a way it's like, ah, dang, oof, hurts a little bit because it kind of just messes with the vision. I feel like creatives, when we like think things through, if it doesn't get to go exactly or remotely close, it's kind of like, Ugh, it kind of hurts a little bit. Oh, I want a thousand subscribers. I'm saying all that to say I want a thousand subscribers. I'm gonna do what I can and I'm gonna do what I gotta do to get to where I wanna be in life. And if being at a million subscribers is like a dream for me, then so be it, cause it's a dream for others. I wanna have that plaque. I wanna have it. And I'm gonna start off with the small baby steps. I'm at 130 subscribers right now. I don't remember. It's either 120 or 130, but either way it goes, I'm only like, 800 and something away from a thousand y'all help me get there if y'all believe and dream <laughs> no i'm just playing I, I i ain't martin luther king i ain't about to go i ain't about to go that way with it being relatable i know that that's gonna make a significant difference i look at youtube like layers of blueprints that you have to follow to get to a thousand 5,000, 10,000, and then 100,000, and then a million. I feel like there's a blueprint. And then as I continue to like edit my videos, I'm like, Janelle, why are you trying to be like other people? Girl, stop. Stop it right now. Stop. Because that is not the way to go. And you know it's not. Like, it's we're not about to do that. Not today. Not, not on my watch. Not on my watch. Not on my watch. <laughs> Drew is going to freaking love that. <laughs> like, I listen. I want a thousand subscribers. Hit that like button. Go back, like a couple videos or two. Check out my content. We also have a podcast on Spotify, basically on all podcasting sites. There are episodes. I googled my name. I'm on. Listen, I have the RSS feed. I'm everywhere, baby. You can see me on Google Podcast, Spotify, Apple, Apple. I'm about to glitch into the system again. Apple Podcasts, Spotify, iHeartRadio, Google Podcasts. Um, basically, if you look up the Nelly Drayton show, for some strange reason, I had no idea. I had listeners on other websites, on other podcasting sites. Huh? What? If you listen to me and then you go out and you make change and you do what you got to do that's, that's in your lane... Baby, that's the goal. That is my goal. My goal is not to just be out here. My goal is to use my voice to inspire people to go beyond. What is your goal beyond? I don't know. Tell me about it. Email me. Send me something. Don't send me anything. But you know what I'm saying? Just, just communicate with your girl. If you are out here trying to go beyond, tap into the Nelly Drayton Show podcast because we be talking about some stuff. I know we be off topic in the very beginning. Starting a podcast is very hard. We tried our best to stay on topic, but I promise you, boo-boo, we getting it together. Creating something that's never been created before, we've never been shown before. Like I'm like the first in my bloodline to do a lot of the things that I'm doing. Another, another reason why I don't know how to do it, how to get started. There is no blueprint to being a creative. Just do it. We're going to be like Nike and what? <laughs> We're going to be like Nike and what? I say that because I need to just do it. At the end of the day, we just going to do it. We're going to be like Nike and just do it. That is not a sponsoring. That is no connections to Nike. I just love the saying. And I'm going to represent that wholeheartedly for the rest of my life because it's authentically true. Be who you are. Ask for the likes. Ask for the subscribers. While you, and be bold about it. There are people that want to subscribe to your channel. And I look at comments of other YouTubers and I see people like, we are so glad that you're like here and we're happy. You know, we're, listen, people need the connection. People need connection. We cannot do this alone. Subscribe to other people's channels. You see me connected with other people. If I start going out into the world and I'm connected to another subscriber, don't be petty and I subscribe to them because you only subscribe to me. Subscribe to that man. Subscribe to that woman. Subscribe to that person. Because at the end of the day, man, listen. <laughs> <laughs> it is time to unite okay we need each other to elevate in this world people gatekeep information people like to hold information to themselves they try to knock you down water you down uh, you know make it to where they can basically digest you really they can choke because we're gonna be big and bold you understand what you want to do in this world because you only have one life okay you got to do it and you got to do it boldly be who you are who did that dimpy 
I think it's Dempy. He's one of my favorite TikTokers. He be coming up with the best scenarios and stories. And, you, and there is no limit. He has a story for everything. Like there is no, oh, he only speaks, he only speaks, only specifically stays in this genre. He only sticks to these types of stories. He be making up stuff. Like whatever he comes up with, the skits is going to come. Like him, Tony Talks, one guy's name who did the free, um, I don't remember, it's on the tip of my tongue. He's he's black, he's a very handsome man. But where he's like drinking the water and he's like, I'm thirsty, just need a drink. And they're like, I said freeze. I know, freeze. I was like, oh, I froze, <laughs> ugly. That made me excited to see that because I'm learning special effects. I'm um, trying to do stuff in Blender. I'm going on and on about the things that I'm doing. So if you don't see me post content on a consistent basis, like every day, every other day, every week, nine times out of 10, I'm editing. And it might not be for the YouTube channel. It might be for the podcast. I'm trying to create a, like a recap of what we've done so far because we're about to come up to our one year anniversary. Shout out to the almost one year anniversary of the Millie Drake Show podcast. Oh, we've been trying to hang in there, baby. It is rough. It is rough. It is rough. It is rough. What's that? Rojo. Am I saying it wrong? <laughs> oh my I don't know. Like, is this one of those other language things you're doing again? <laughs> <laughs> He's like... <laughs> what are we doing? Yeah, but uh, we didn't rehearse this. Rojo, it, it's not... It's That's not how you're supposed to pronounce it. What are you pronouncing? Right in Spanish. <laughs> no, I'm up and I'm late. Oh my God, he's probably wondering where I am. What am I doing? I had to cut it short because I'm short on time. Time is never on my side anymore. Is it because I'm black? <laughs> Anyways, like, subscribe. Again, subscribe and then like. After you're done liking, subscribe to the channel. Subscribe to Drew. Drew is somewhere on here. If you scroll down to the very bottom, you'll see where I put Creative Family. You'll see Bell's Taco. That's my daughter. Freaking love her. Mm, don't get me started on my kid. You guys like this? Love this. And want more of it. I don't know why. Janelle, what? And welcome to the Nelly Drayton Show. Where creatives kind of, sort of figure it out. And we gather to go beyond. Let's do this.